Hello and welcome to this lecture. So in previous lecture you understood what is Pandas library. In this lecture I will show you a small demo of Pandas library and once you are through with Pandas library and how it works then in the next lecture you are going to work on the system integration project where you are going to write a python program which will integrate a flat file coming from third parties to your database table so let's begin let's see how python uses pandas library so to begin with i will take you through this site the link to this site is mentioned in the description to this lecture on this site there is this uk500 dot csv file is kept so if you open that file that is how this file looks like it just has some dummy details like first name last name company name address city country postal code phone numbers and email address and web right these are all dummy uh, data what we're going to do is using pandas library we are going to read this csv from this website and take that data into pandas data frame so let's begin first thing you are going to do is import pandas library so import pandas as pd very very good and next it's very easy name your data frame i'm going to name it as df and then just say pd dot read csv we know that uh, that uh, site contains this csv file because this one here is a csv file uk 500 dot csv so that's why we are going to use read csv function in the pandas library and then provide the link from where pandas will pick that csv file very good here and that's it now the data from that dot csv file came to pandas data frame and i can just print here the complete data frame and it will show me all the records right here so now the data has come to pandas data frame and i can play around with this data there are 500 rows with 11 columns all the data is available in pandas data frame now so what if i just want the email address so i can just say df email and right here I have all the email addresses so like that I can slice and dice this data I can play around with it once it is in the pandas data frame then I can do any kind of analysis I can do slicing and dicing I can uh, just do pattern recognition I can plot chart on all of this data available in data frame so that is the beauty of pandas data frame it makes the task of importing data and analyzing the data very easy by the way in case you are wondering what is the process if this csv file is at your local desk uh, it, if the csv file is in your local folder in your computer or some server it's very easy let's do that let's say i'm going to save this file save as uh, uk500.csv and uh, let's say I save this folder in Sanjay uh, Python Oracle and data so I already have this file here right okay I save it there it says replace yes and then you can do the same thing that you can use pd.readcsv but instead of giving that website detail here you will get 
you will give the folder details the location of the folder where the file is kept so let's do that let's say df1 equal to pd dot read csv and over here just provide the folder path where it is kept so let's go that let's go there quickly here and uh, go to data okay so this is where it is kept and the file name is uk 500.csv say r here right there okay and now if you say df1 right there you got the same data in a different data frame df1 and the df1 data frame is reading from the folder and that's what you are going to do in the next lecture those files those flat files from your manufacturer is coming to somewhere in your system in your uh, server or somewhere the where you have access to that folder and from that folder you are going to read it into pandas data frame and then from pandas data frame you will transfer the data to database table awesome i'll see you in next lecture